Welcome to Mega Talk. We're still the talk show in boxing. What is going on between Sonny Edwards and Conor Ben? It's a few times now I've heard Sonny Edwards bring up Ben's name into conversation, dissing him. Today he was going in and saying something. I'm going to play a couple of clips for you so you can listen for yourself and tell me what you think. I'll give comments in a second. This interview was with Boxing Media. Um, you know what the funniest thing is? This is an exclusive. My biggest gripe with Conor Ben was the fact that I thought he was a <laughs> brother. A <laughs> brother. And as someone that, you know, takes them things quite sensitively, um... Yeah, I kind of gave it to him a little bit more than I probably needed to, which is mad because then I ended up falling out with my friend who I was sort of giving him digs for, really. Here he alludes to falling out with Harley Ben, which is Conor Ben's brother, um, over the fact that Conor Ben wasn't a very nice brother. Harley Ben, yeah? Yes, I'm about Harley Ben, unfortunately. I didn't really want to mention his name. What, what, what have you guys fallen out over? Oh, no, he just unfollowed me and everything and then just kept himself distant and before he was ringing my phone and, you know, opened up to me and that. And I'm not going to go into too much, yeah? He explains that Harley unfollowed him on Twitter and because of that now they're not talking, they're not friends. Does this sound a little bit schoolboyish to you? Dust to me. So where does it really go from here? It's not as if they're the same weight. They're about eight or nine divisions away from each other in weight. They're not friends. They're not really going to meet up with each other. So my question is, why is Sonny going on the way that he's going on? He did explain that Conor Ben did see him when he first came back and he went into the arena and with his security guards and he saw him there. He looked on Conor, Conor just looked on him and Conor walked away. But if Conor's not scared of Kel Brook, who's a welterweight champion, you know, who's fought at middleweight, I'm sure he's not going to be scared of a flyweight who's eight divisions or so lighter than him but if I was Sonny I think it's time now to cool down you've made your point he says that he doesn't agree with the drug allegations and rightfully so nobody does agree with the drug allegations and we hope that the truth does come out one day and it is dealt accordingly and he says even if the 270 page document proves that Connor's innocent he's still not going to believe it there's underground grievances between these two. I don't know about you. I'm going to watch this one to see where it goes. I want to see what happens when I do meet in public. Thank you anyway all. Thank you all for listening to Mega Talk. Remember subscribe. Talk to you soon.